This week, it's the turn of one of the leading contenders in the stiff competition that is, the dullest system in Hutton space, but yet is close to the hearts of many a Hutton trucker. It's the rather precisely but unimaginatively named WISE 0855-0714. Its name, the dread of radio presenters from Gamma for Natchez to 36 off Yuki, is affectionately and conveniently shortened to WISE and we dread to control a second WISE system lest we have to differentiate. The system was discovered in the early 21st century, 2013 to be exact, by the Wide Field Infrared Survey Explorer or WISE telescope after which it is named. The 0855714 part isn't even a drunken attempt by some long forgotten nostalgic astronomer attempting to recall the telephone number of a childhood holoscreen show but merely its galactic coordinates when viewed from the Sol system. Right ascension 8 hours 55 minutes, declination minus 7 degrees 14 minutes. How excruciatingly dull is that? Wise, being a sub-brown dwarf, about seven times the size of Jupiter, is only the fourth farthest system from Sol, a mere 7.2 light years away. In fact, it is a system so insignificant that it wasn't noticed until 400 years after the invention of the telescope. This isn't as uncommon as you might think, as 50 of the 60 closest stars to Sol are too dim to be seen with the naked eye. It's a pretty cold, dark and gloomy system with a handful of icy worlds, plus two gas giants with icy rings sporting a clutch of res sites. Why is a refinery system has a small population of just under 35,000, which is largely confined to its single outpost, Yamazaki Landing. WISE may boast a single outpost but keeps rather quieter about its two planetary stations, neither of which are open to commercial traffic. One is an agricultural station, where mildly eccentric scientists experiment on unsuspecting brassicas, and the other a hush-hush medium security station where no doubt devious plots are hatched, moustaches are twirled, and security guards in red sweaters curse their sudden but inevitable betrayal and doom. Yamazaki, the outpost, situated just under a thousand light clicks out from the dim star, does have two vaguely redeeming features. The first being that it allows you to drop out of supercruise 8,000 kilometres from the station, allowing for high speed approaches whilst dodging the pirate scum that frequent the system. It even retains the welded up access ports and pirate banners that nobody could be bothered to take down, and hey, they do come in handy every Halloween. The second is that it's named after a rather pleasant Japanese malt whisky. That's it. Nothing else. It's a proper dump. But it's our dump. Despite its apparent lack of redeeming features, Wise holds a special place in the hearts of truckers. It was here where we learnt for the first time what the result of being in unplanned expansion meant. Joyous faces were amazed to see that Hutton had become a parent after an albeit very brief gestation period. Nowadays, Hutton practices planned expansion and we demand a DNA test, that's a do not acquire test, to see if we really want to own up to and raise where we've expanded into. Yes, Y0855-0714 is our first born system beyond Alpha Centauri and we love it dearly despite its utter lack of attractiveness, ability, ambition large pads, or intention to ever tidy its bedroom. So there we have it. WISE was the first system to take its place below Alpha Centauri in Hutton's hierarchy, a position it has steadfastly maintained until even now, despite the other 23 intervening systems, sinking down the ladder of success with each new acquisition, languishing in the relegation zone of backwater oblivion. <laughs>